It looks like a weapon out of a science fiction movie, but a new heat device could help get fighting inmates under control safely. It was demonstrated today at the L.A. County Prison in Castaic, and our Leo Stallworth was a test subject. Within the first six months of this year, there have been a half a dozen major disturbances at the Pitches Detention Center's North County Correctional Facility. To quell such violence, jailers like street cops are trained to use tasers, pepper spray, batons, and more if necessary. However, inmates need to be aware if they stir up any violence at pitches in the future, they could face the assault intervention device. This device packs enough heat literally to stop just about anyone in their tracks. We're looking for a device that would enable us uh, to intervene in the assault, perhaps lessen its severity, without putting either, the, either of the potential assailants in a position of disadvantage so that they would then become the victim of a crime. We believe that we've found such a device. The assault intervention device transmits a focused, invisible millimeter wave at a body troublemaking inmate, causing an intolerable heating sensation. Once zapped, that inmate will dash out of the way, giving deputies time to move in and stop the trouble. But what we're looking for is something to fill that gap between the time when an assault starts and the time that we can get sufficient deputy personnel available on scene to actually intervene in the assault. That's where this device developed by Raytheon Company comes in. Sheriff officials will mount it on a wall in a jail dorm, housing some 650 inmates for the next six months free of charge as part of a pilot program. The first of its kind device is controlled by a deputy who looks through a monitor and with a joystick points at a target and zaps. To show its effects, I got zapped. Do it! No! <laughs> the burning sensation is similar to putting your hand over fire and leaving it there until it gets too hot and you snatch it away. The beam or wave can hit a target up to 85 feet away. Pitches is the first correctional facility in the nation to test the device. In Castaic, Leo Starr, ABC 7 Eyewitness News.